One of the new features that uh, was announced with iOS 16 is lockdown mode and I tried to see what the effects of the lockdown mode is and I will say that the lockdown mode that is being rolled out is severely limited and here is why. One of the things that lockdown mode is supposed to do is blocking attachments to messages and from what I have seen, this message blocking, this attachment blocking only works with iMessage, which means that if somebody wants to send you an attachment, they can send it via email, they can also send attachments via WhatsApp or any other messaging platform. So which means that the lockdown mode only works on iMessage when it comes to blocking of attachment. Now, another thing that was announced to be coming with the lockdown mode, the people that can contact you via FaceTime. That means that a person that you have, you have not contacted before via FaceTime cannot call you via FaceTime. That's fine. But a person that has never called you via WhatsApp can still call you. So which means that the lockdown mode is only going to, in that area of video calls, is only going to affect FaceTime calls. But other forms of video calls can still go through, which to me, I don't think is the best. Google Photos also has this feature of sharing albums or sharing images once you snap a photograph it is one of the images that is supposed to be shared with someone it will be shared the same feature also exists on iCloud where you can have a shared album and lockdown mode is supposed to remove that shared album pending when the lockdown mode is turned off but even with lockdown mode on you can still share your your albums and your images using other forms of Im image sharing applications such as Google Photos etc so in that case I do not think that lockdown mode is doing enough so I would still say that lockdown mode is limited in that regard. In my experience with lockdown mode, I have also noticed that wired connections are, are blocked just as it is advertised. Wired connections are blocked and you have to unlock your device to be able to either use your PC to charge your phone or to use your PC to transfer files, which I give them a thumbs up for that. In my own personal experience as well, I did not experience any limitation or any difficulty browsing the internet using uh, even when lockdown mode is on, mainly because uh, I believe that the lockdown mode only affects browsing features when you are making use of Safari. I use Chrome and as a result, I did not get any inconvenience or any limitations as a result of lockdown mode using Chrome. Having looked at all these areas that are supposed to be affected by lockdown mode, I can now say that lockdown mode as advertised will only affect apps that were developed or that are part of the Apple ecosystem. So if you are like me that browses with Chrome, chats with WhatsApp, stores your photos on Google Cloud, then the lockdown mode will be of no effect to you. So basically I would say that lockdown mode is limited and it, le it leaves a lot to be de desired. That it should be improved such that when the phone is on lockdown, it will affect all the apps that are on the device and that will go a very long way instead of affecting only Apple's apps or apps that are part of the Apple ecosystem. If this video was useful to you, please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.